From Australia to California to Canada, the last few years have been marked by intense wildfire, and lots of it. And while wildfires are a natural part of our ecosystem, climate change is speeding things up, and that could outstrip our forest's ability to regenerate themselves. Fire experts say Canada has about 6,000 fires each year, burning around 2.5 million hectares. That's doubled what we saw early in the 1970s. So how is climate change speeding things up? Well, scientists have identified three major ways. One is our longer summers. Wildfire seasons now start about a month earlier than what they used to. Number two, more lightning. Now, while we're getting better about human-caused fires, we can't control the skies. And with warmer, unsettled summer weather, we can expect more storms, more lightning, and that means more chances for fires to start. The third factor is probably the most important when it comes to wildfire spread, drier fire fuels. Our increasingly hot and dry summers are really good at sucking moisture out of our vegetation, making them the perfect kindling. So what does this all mean for us? Scientists say we only have to look a little further south to see what Canada's future could look like. In the western United States, where wildfire burn areas are four times the size they were 50 years ago. Now, the good news is that our ability to manage these extreme fire scenarios is always improving. Thinning vegetation and doing prescribed burns helps keep wildfires under control, while still leaving room for the natural wildfire cycles our forests need to stay healthy.